Hi guys, this is Victor from webautomation.io. And in this video, I'm going to show you how to scrape reviews for business software uh, from G2, which is by far the largest website for business products and software reviews. Um, so I'm going to do this using Web Automation's no-code data extractor. Uh, so first of all, let's find something to scrape. Uh, I'm going to scrape a random product. All I need to do is search. I can see the Zapier has got 911 reviews. All I need to do is copy this link and then head over to Web Automation. Um, I'm currently on Web Automation. Um, now, if I start from the top, I'm on the dashboard. Um, so to guys, to follow this video, you need to either sign up for an account or you need to sign into an account. So that's just step one. Uh, once you have signed up for an account, uh, then you can start following the video. So then you head over to the marketplace. And then you search for G2. And you can see our G2 review scraper. Well, you sign on there and then you can activate the scraper to get it started. Once you've activated it, now all you need to do is put in that link we copied from G2 into the input starter links option. And then you can update the links. Once you've updated it, you can either start running or you can put some limits. So I'm just gonna put 20 rows. And this is how many reviews I want. Uh, once we are all done, we can press the big run now button. And that's it. We up and running. So the extractor is now going to crawl through G2 and we're going to be able to see reviews uh, from G2 in a few minutes. So as you can see now, it's completed. Um, scrape 25 rows of G2. So let's have a look and see what it looks like. So you have options to download a CSV, XML, Excel, JSON, or JSON line. I'm going to use Excel as I have this open already. Save onto my local. And we can open and see what the data looks like. Bring this over here. And we can see the, part, the title of the product, uh, the summary of the product overview, the rating, number of reviews, some other stuff. But let's get to the interesting parts, which is the review heading. So we can see all the review titles. We can see the actual review URL. You can see the dates of the review. You can see the rating of the review. You can see the reviewer's name. Uh, you can see the title of the reviewer, company type, company size, any tags, any likes, any dislikes, any recommendation. And the timestamp. So you can see uh, clearly with just a few in a few minutes, uh, I've been able to show you exactly how to scrape uh, reviews from G2 without writing any code and just clicking a few buttons in a few minutes. Okay, uh, that's it for now. Um, I'm going to go back into Web Automation, show you some other stuff you can do. So once you have completed this, you can either rerun the scraper uh, to scrape the same thing, or you can go into the inputs and you can put a different URL in here to get a different output. Uh, you can create a, a similar type as well. Uh, you can even go in here, uh, start, stop, uh, or even do some advanced 
uh, stuff like integrate with uh, API or MySQL, or AWS, or whatever options that um, might be suitable for you. But I can't really wait for you guys to go ahead and try this yourself. Um, let me know how you get on, and I'll see you at the next video.